Hey there, this is Matteo from Spot Home Milano and today we're in Via San Faustino in the Ortica neighborhood in order to show you a whole apartment with three bedrooms, two bathrooms, kitchen and living room which is structured on two different floors. So we have the ground floor at the bottom and the first floor right here. So now let's just go ahead and let me show you around. So this is the entrance to our apartment and as we were here we found ourselves in the kitchen while through the corridor in front of us we access the rest of the apartment with the first bathroom here on the left. Here we find the living room with bedroom number one being here on the top while through these uh, little stairs we access the bottom floor where we have the other two bedrooms and the second bathroom. So we just briefly begin our tour from the kitchen which is shared between all of the three bedrooms. It is uh, fully equipped with this uh, nice wooden table and a couple of seats in the middle of the room. We have a luminous window overlooking the interior courtyard where you also have a bike rack as you can tell just in case you own one. While on the kitchen counter, which is uh, very stylish and colorful, we find a set of knives hanging here on the magnetic pin, plenty of cupboards on the top, and a transparent one here too with some glasses and cups for the breakfast. This nice uh, space just behind the double sink where you can hang some utensils, including the coffee machine. But at the bottom, you have plenty of drawers for organizing your stuff. In here you find a nice and wide set of cutlery and you have more storage compartments all around including some uh, nice pots and there's even more room in here for the food. Continuing on the kitchen counter we find this uh, colorful toaster and a kettle for the tea. More cupboards on the top and here you have the fan right on top of the gas stove, nice and modern. We have the oven immediately underneath. On the side you have some more drawers and at the end here we find a spacious uh, modern fridge with the freezer immediately underneath. On the top there you also have a storage compartment in case you have any luggage to store. And as we mentioned through this uh, door we access the first of the two bathrooms with the sink on top of this, uh, oh pardon, uh, mirror on top of the large sink behind the entrance door which is uh, tilting in a very peculiar way. We have a cupboard, both of the toilets here, the bathroom and bidet. And in here we find a top load washing machine with the rack just on the side as well as a spacious uh, box shower here with uh, double hooks, nice and spacious. The ceiling is uh, very tall as you can tell with these nice uh, inserts and wooden material on the ceiling couple of uh, shelvings there on the side. Well, as for the living room, we have this uh, cozy corner with a couch and a flat screen TV right in front of it. Some shelvings on the side. And on the opposite end, we find the standalone wardrobe with a simple zip and some uh, coat hangers. In that corner, you also have a full length mirror and this uh, luminous window, which is just overlooking the interior courtyard of another residential building. While through these uh, wooden steps we access uh, the bed number one which is uh, just uh, on top of the living room as you can tell. The ceiling is just a little bit tight but still there's plenty of room to sleep in here with a single bed and we have a cupboard in that corner with a couple of shelvings just on top of the bed. Now regarding the location as we mentioned we're in the Ortica neighborhood we have the Tram number 5 connecting you to the city center and uh, leading you up to the San Babida neighborhood where you can catch the underground line number 1. Now we're proceeding uh, downstairs, so to the ground floor where as we mentioned we find the other two bedrooms. So we have first of all bedroom number 3 on the right and bedroom number 2 on the left. We also have a secondary access from there, so you can access better number 2 directly. And it is a large double room with two single beds, each of them with their bedside tables. We have a window overlooking the private courtyard, just like the, the other access. Behind here you also have an additional little sink, some shelvings, and on that corner, as you can tell, we have a couple of uh, standalone wardrobes. A little one here and a very tall in here. 
So very tall and spacious indeed. This cute set of uh, drawers. It's nice for organizing your stuff too. And there's more room in here with some coat hangers. And the second bathroom of the apartment is located just between uh, bedroom number two and three. In this one we find just the butter, in this case, a little cupboard here and a small sink with a box shower with curtain, again with a double hoods, so nice and modern. And as a final step we can show you bedroom number three, which is in this case set up as a single one with this uh, nice uh, single bed and a metal frame all around, which is pretty cool. A little bedside table on the side and some uh, shelvings in here as well. Again, notice the colorful walls, which are very nice. In this bedroom we also find a couch and uh, we have another standalone wardrobe in this corner, nice and spacious. We also have a chest of drawers at the bottom and the window is just overlooking the same courtyard that we've seen from the living room. And with this we should do everything, so thanks for watching, see you next time. Ciao ciao!